This is the big story presented by HerbChambers.com. Hi, I'm Chad Finn from Boston.com and this is the big story. Well, you wouldn't know it from looking outside, but this is opening day for the Red Sox. Maybe snowy here, but it's supposed to be 80 degrees in Arlington, Texas, where the Red Sox open up at 4 o'clock this afternoon. It's been a long time coming. I can't think of a, an off season that, uh, a new season that's been as anticipated as this one in the previous off season. not only because uh, uh, last year kind of slipped away from them early and they were never really, uh, never really in the race, but they went out and got uh, fixed every problem that they had with this team in the offseason. They got Carl Crawford, a speedster with a little bit of power from Tampa Bay to play left field. He's going to bat third. And the real bobble here is uh, Adrian Gonzalez, a power hitting first baseman who spent uh, the past few seasons in San Diego, the worst hitters ballpark in baseball, in a lineup with a bunch of guys who wouldn't crack the Red Sox starting lineup. Now he comes here, left-handed hitter to a ballpark perfectly suited for his talent, surrounded by Dustin Pedroia, Crawford, Euclid, Big Poppy. He's going to be a monster, and it's going to be really fun to see how this team pulls it together. The expectations are huge. Uh, everybody at the Globe in this, our Sunday baseball section last week, six riders picked the Red Sox to win the AL East and get to the World Series. I think it was 38 out of 45 at ESPN picked the Red Sox to get to the World Series. Those are staggering, uh, staggering uh, predictions, uh, but it tells you how good this team is. And the truth is, they should be that good. There aren't a lot of flaws here. The lineup is as deep as they've had since 2004 in the Manny Poppy heyday. Uh, the pitching staff has a little bit of concern in the starting rotation. Josh Beckett, John Lackey, Dice K. Mac Matsuzaka were all pretty mediocre at best last year, but they're also accomplished pitchers. Lackey's in great shape. Beckett looked great in his last spring start. And at the top of the rotation, you have John Lester, who should. Uh, uh, is a prohibitive favorite, let's say, to win the, the AL signing award. And Clay, Buckle, Clay Buckles, who had a fantastic year last year, 2.33 RA, 17 wins, uh, is a great number two starter. The bullpen's rebuilt. It's another thing General Manager Theo Epstein uh, fixed in the offseason. And 1 through 25, this is as good a team as they've had in a long time, and that includes 2004 and 2007 when, uh, uh, as we know, they won it all. And it goes beyond the 25 because they have 10 pitchers in Pawtucket with major league experience. So uh, barring catastrophe, which is kind of what happened last year, but barring catastrophe, this should be a great baseball team.